Today we're talking about, let's just say, um, a very interesting person. <laughs> I'll probably say shot in the head too. Um, Look at this dude. This guy is called DJ and di diet save poppy dot com. That, that, that's literally his ad. I, I'm not kidding. He literally just added a website, which is a pretty interesting username, I must say. The whole point of this guy's TikTok, which has around 38,000 followers, which are <laughs> is less than me, I must say. Bro, I'm not even a TikToker and I still get more followers than these vegan TikTokers. Basically, all he does is just post videos to his page uh, of him just going around in public harassing kids for no reason, just pissing people off to spread his vegan vegan message or whatever, you know, it's kind of classical, right? Because we've, we've talked about similar vegans in the past, right? Like I've talked about that vegan teacher, deep vegan. Oh my God, bro. Deep vegan was a character, bro. Do we all remember deep vegan? What, what an absolute character. Okay. No, nah. I actually, actually, if we get 5,000 likes this video, I'll make a video on like where deep vegan is now, or like where is deep vegan? Cause I'm genuinely kind of interested because that man was on a whole nother level of just, just weird, honestly. Now just to be straight up and honest with you all, right? This guy who we're going to be talking about today, he's, he's his name is DJ Andy, right? Okay, so so DJ Andy save poppy.com. Let, let's just say that his name is DJ Andy. I'm 99% sure that this guy in his videos is is just being completely ironic, right? Like I, I'm pretty sure he's being ironic in these videos, but it is still pretty funny, right? And we're going to be watching these today because uh, the, these videos that you're about to watch are a little bit weird. He's an Australian, right? So, so, so he, he's, he's from our country. He's from this great nation of Australia and uh, he, he's kind of ruining what it is to be in Australia. I'm not going to lie. When you think of Australians, a lot of people are going to think of this guy and that's kind of a sad thing. To, that's kind of a sad thing to see. So what we're going to be doing in today's video, um, we're, we're just going to be looking at these guys' videos and at the end, we're going to be ranking him out of 10. So we're, we're going to see how good he is. All right, let's just have a look at these. I, I, enough talking, enough, enough, enough bullshit. How can you say you love an animal? You're paying hey, 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 I love the fucking tape. Oh, God damn. Okay, first video, right. Firstly, this guy is going out in public and just going to a bunch of kids who literally just come from school. Like, bro, they got their school uniform on. And this guy's just going out talking to them for the re for the reaction. I don't know why he's doing this. It kind of doesn't make sense to me. Animal Defender asks, how can you say you love an animal when, when you're when you're paying for them to have their head axed off? And the, uh, this guy just says, I love the taste. Fair enough, bro. You know, I, 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 I can agree with that. That isn't funny. Stop doing it. This kid's name is Alex. Alex, stop doing it. Bro, men just left a whole ass KFC bucket on, on a vegan's car. Trust me, if you leave any sort of like animal products on a vegan's car, expect to have a video made on you by DJ Andy Save Poppy. Bro, the, this guy's t this guy's got a t-shirt that says running. I swear all these vegans are the same, bro. Like, like they're, they're all athletes, which is fine, right? But it's like, they're, they're all arrogant athletes. On this video, people, tell Alex to stop doing it now. Not funny. Oh, so we don't comment, do we? Alex is a legend. I hope that doesn't get me like striked from YouTube. I hope I'm not harassing anyone. I'm not bullying anyone. Oh uh, yeah, YouTube can suck off. I'm getting tired of this. This Alex kid has done it again. <laughs> Alex is, uh, bro, Alex just keeps doing it. Oh my God. What, what, what a criminal. On my vegan vegan car again by Alex. Because you guys have encouraged him. And he's even written, eat meat. Bra, whatever bra means. You should be commenting, stop it now, um, Alex, and go vegan. Stop it now, <gasps> uh, Alex, and go vegan. <clears throat> At the end of every video, he just goes, Ugh. Oh, why? I feel like this guy, I, I, I don't know what it is. I feel like there's something about this guy that makes me think that he might be the one riding the Alex on the KFC buckets. No, I'm not, I'm not sure what it is. No, I, I, okay, I, I might just be picky. M maybe there is a guy called Alex who's going around just <laughs> riding on KFC boxes and throwing them at his car. So with the method of killing, um, I was going to say right now, this guy, this guy, this guy's mic sounds like he's shoving a dildo up his dick. Human volunteers to be eaten for alien taste buds. What the? Mm. What happened to society, bro? Like, is this really what's happening? To be um, shot in the head with a bolt first, or, or do you just want to skip that bit and just be stabbed? <laughs> I can't be asked, bro. It's like these fucking vegans don't understand that like animals aren't the same as humans, right? And uh, we we don't we, we we're not supposed to have our heads chopped off because like we're not supposed to be eaten. Locally farmed humans, human slaughter, bro. This guy is this guy the same as Deep Vegan, bro? For those of you that remember, I talked about Deep Vegan like a year ago. He's basically someone who hates humanity, right? Because we're we're, we're so we're so terrible to animals. Oh no, guys, we're so terrible. But then. He's a human himself. I don't get why vegans say humans are horrible when, like, you're, you're a human yourself. What the fuck? I'll be shot in the head. Uh, what do you think? Uh, I'll probably say shot in the head, too. Yeah? It'll be a captive bolt pistol. So, when you go into the knock box, um, they'll shoot it right into your brain so it'll be nice and quick and you won't feel a thing. You okay with that? Yeah. 
So with the meth- No, you're not, bro. Shut up. Why should we have to justify why we eat animals, bro? It's a source of protein. It's part of our diet. It's not something that, like, we can change until there's a proper method of solution, in, in which case we should be getting proper vegan food. Bro, don't talk to me about all this bullshit of, like, oh, yeah, vegan food, it, it's, it's great for a balanced diet. Okay, yeah, yeah, cool, right? If, if you want to stick to a strict vegan diet and be unhappy, then go for it, bro. But, like, I don't want to sit here counting calories and being, uh, being a complete, being a complete, like, psychopath with my diet. I just want to eat what I want to eat and get the basic amount of nutrients. Bro, I'm, you're not going to sit, you're not, you're not going to see me sitting here counting calories and making it, like, a daily job to eat just because I want to eat vegan. Like, bro, I, I'm sorry, but, like, it, it, it's just, it, the, me going vegan completely outweighs all the, all the good things that are going to come from me going vegan. Bit of killing, um, are you guys happy to be, um, it's, it's, just, it's just crap, bro. Like, like the, firstly, get get a real mic, okay? And secondly, shut up. Giving away free vouchers, Kentucky Fried Human. Yep, these humans were farmed um, locally. <laughs> it's so funny because no one's listening to you, bro. You're, you're talking to a brick wall. Where's that meme, bro? Yo, yo, Landon, Landon, play, play that meme of, like, the, the guy, uh, the, the, the guy talking to a brick wall. That's literally what, what this guy is doing right now, bro. He's literally, like, he's literally got props and everything, and everyone's probably just walked past and they're just like, don't care. You mainly slaughtered. So, support the, uh, human farmers. Farmers' livelihood depends on it. You mainly slaughtered human. Nothing better. Good source of iron, protein. You don't want to be, don't want to be, trust those vegans. What it's very unhealthy. Is this? Bro, well, I, I don't understand everything about these vegan TikTokers, right? They have so much propaganda on their fucking screen. Bro, we got free, yum, tender meat baby. What the, what is a tender meat baby? Bro, what, <laughs> you don't want to trust those vegans. It's very unhealthy. Bro, what, why? This kid followed your advice and put two boxes of dead Hell birds kid. on my vegan calf. It's disgusting. Give him a, an L. This guy's such a troll. No, no. I, 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 the, the thing is, right, this guy's probably not even vegan. He's probably just doing it to, to get followers and shit. Bro, th this is funny, right? I'll, I'll give it to this guy. If he's doing it ironically, he's funny. If he's doing it because he actually believes in it. He's a bit of a weirdo, I'm not gonna lie. L for pranking vegan. Oh, dear. How, how, how dare you prank vegan? Bro, all the comments are just W only. W, mate. Good job. W, W. L equals legend. Yeah, bro, that's actually facts. No, no. This guy's calling this guy a legend. L equals legend. Legend kid and and W kid, bro. Th this is this is good. And then at dinner time, it's just a big okay, bag I'm about this, bro. The, why do the vegans put so much fucking text on their screen? All vegans are dead, but where do you get your protein? I don't, I don't get protein. I've been dead for about eight years now. What? Salad with some potatoes on it. Yeah. Where do you get protein? And then at dinner time, it's just a big okay, bag about. Okay, I'm not about. gonna lie. A, lo a lot of non-vegans like myself. I mean, let's just be real. A lot of non-vegans are kind of retarded. I'm not gonna lie. They say a lot of things like, "Oh, where where do you get your protein from?" And to be honest, I was the same. If you guys watch my older videos, I used to say that sort of stuff all the time. Like, where do you get your protein? It's pretty easy to get protein when you're not a vegan. Actually, I take that back. It's not easy, but it's very possible, and it's not it's not outrageous to get to get protein when you're not a vegan. Or should I say, it's 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 easy to get protein when you're a vegan, but not as easy as if you're not. A so all the people are like, oh, where do you get your protein from, bro? It's, 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 it's not like you can't get protein if, if you're vegan. But like, uh, the, the, the thing that people don't understand is that when you're vegan, it is a lot harder to get all the nutrients that, that you need. It is possible, but it's, it's difficult, right? But it's not impossible. Okay. So I, I, I do understand, right? Because it, it, I do, I don't get why vegans think everyone should be on a vegan diet. That's just not sustainable at the, at the point that we're at right now. Maybe in like 50 years time, when, when developed elements in diet and everything have gotten a lot better. Sure, I'll go on a vegan diet at that point. If you can make food that, that tastes the exact same and is a, 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 it is accessible to get, as the food that we've got now, then sure, bro, I'll go vegan. If, if it means, if it means, if it, like, I, I'd rather eat something that tastes the same and gives me the same protein with, with something that isn't harming an animal than something that is. I feel like I'm rambling a bit, but like, yeah. Hi, DJ Andy. Guess what? Kill yourself. <laughs> That's my name at bowling. Hi, DJ Andy. That was so crazy, bro. I feel like I, I feel like I've reached the end of this guy's just r stupidness. Uh, yeah, so this was DJ Andy. If you want me to make another video on him, or if DJ Andy, you're watching this video, uh, make a TikTok on me so I can respond to you and, and get and get more content. I'm kind of running low. Oh uh, yeah, thank you all for watching, and uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next video. Bye.